Hey everybody, um, some of you may know this house from way back in the past, um, I had done a couple of videos here and uh, this is the abandoned mystery house and I decided to come back four months after my last video um, to see how bad things have got and they've got extremely bad here. Um, this house is really really messed up. If you haven't seen and in my other videos, I'll leave a link down below. Um, and it'll give you an idea of what the place used to look like. But uh, there is a lot of destruction here in the last four months. All these ceilings have been ripped down and Even the furniture, the built-in furniture has been ripped out. That was the wind. That scared the shit out of me. Look at the ceilings here, like. You know, it would be good to see the other video and see a comparison to what it is um, right now. The reason why I call it the abandoned mystery house is because it's a brand, it's it's a it's, it's a relatively new house um, with a lot of top end features and that. It was just left, and um, it's in a lovely location and everything. And it's just sitting here being destroyed. That is the wind, I think. Yeah, it's the wind. Um, what I was showing you there was the, uh, the bathroom and the top end shower that was in it. You know, it's got all these sprayers on the side and everything and this digital readout and stuff. Um, you know, that would have been expensive. Hopefully. Um, this is uh, one of the bedrooms. And out here is the hot tub and... God... The whole thing is destroyed. Um, this here was a little. Uh, it was a little wooden uh, wooden shed that uh, that covered the hot tub. Sorry, I've got no lights or anything like that. I just I didn't plan to even fill up today. But uh, there's the back kitchen and that, or the bathroom. <coughs> oh, the ceilings have all come down and everything. Um, there's no real point in me doing spirit box here because uh, you know it's just a new property. All the toys. This would have been a brilliant kitchen at the time. I showed you this the last time. Um, you know, when you see a, a calendar on the wall, it kind of gives you an idea of when people last stayed here, and it's uh, it's this year, two thousand and fourteen. Do 
In here you have the laundry room. This is going to be just a rough and ready video folks because I didn't actually plan to go anywhere today. Um, I'm still kind of not well but It was kind of cleaned up around the back here. It's kind of, it looks like it's been bulldozed. But there used to be, uh, there used to be a wooden shed around that hot tub. Let's have a look upstairs. And then I'll show you the outbuildings belong to this. But uh, as I says, um, I done a big video on this house uh, about four months ago and I'm going to leave a link down below. Bright with yellow walls. It is the wind but it's still scaring the crap out of me. Um, Bright yellow walls, not my cup of tea, but uh, each to their own, I suppose. Yeah, people have been smashing the walls here and everything. Right, I think we've, we've two bedrooms up here, um, with some built in furniture. Every time I come here, I wonder what happened that this house was left in this kind of condition and abandoned. Because a lot of money went into this. little little attic space and you can see there's brand new tiles still in boxes and stuff you know and you can see the uh, the woodwork it's pretty new that banging door is still scaring me right here we have a little uh, another little attic area here for storing stuff. And the upstairs bathroom. There wasn't even a floor on this. There probably was uh, back at the time, but you can see there's uh, those little things that says the carpet and that. But, uh, yeah, people have been up here and they have been doing damage. Um, this is really dodgy here. Oh my God. Look, there's a hole to the downstairs. What's this? Some sort of electronic device of some kind. Now it's some sort of control panel, panel of some kind. But uh, my car is parked outside. I, do, I don't want to draw attention. Uh, Sorry for having to stop it there for a second. Um, as I'm going down the stairs, there's this what looks like a fly. He heads towards the uh, panel that's in front of me. I want to show you that panel now for a second. You see this panel here? Now a fly goes from, uh, what looks like a fly, it goes from there to there at, at high speed 
and then I can't see it after that. Um, I'm not saying it's paranormal or not, um, but it's just bugging me. Where did it actually go? Um, it looked like it possibly went up towards towards this window here, but I can't see it from here to here. I know it'll disappear with the background here, like, uh, because it is white, but it, it's a white light. Um, probably because of the reflection of what's what's coming in the door but it goes across here and then it kind of it, it just kind of disappears so um, if you know if that's a bug um, let me know and uh, um, it's just I, I just I played it over and over and I, I just can't figure it out my car is parked outside I, I don't want to draw attention and these stairs are starting to uh, get a little bit soft with all the dampness has, has been in here but you can see all the black mould but there was a lot of money put into this house back at the time like yeah we still have tea bags But uh, you've got this artificial beam going across and it actually is just foam made, made to look like wood. I forgot to show you. For those who haven't seen my other videos, and we've got a bar, a bar in here. This is a door that's making all the flipping noise. Right. I was wondering where all the blackness was coming from. Somebody lit a fire here. You know what I hate? I hate when people do these kind of things. Do you know? It gives us all a bad name, like. You know, some of us just want to go out and document things and take photographs and stuff. Do you know? What's the idea behind all this senselessness, like? That door is banging again. Picture of the Last Supper. She's even the wall is even the wall here is broken away. Um, this room was full of furniture at one point, but uh. You can see it was, it was pretty nice the way back in the time. All this dumping at this front of the front of the house, it's all it's all new. People just came in and just dump your rubbish here like. Tires. <coughs> this is an outside shed area, and it's it's all tiled and everything and it's partitioned into different sections and stuff and this area here wasn't even finished <coughs> one of the few windows left that's not been broken 
you an area, another area in here as plumbed and everything, just ready for putting in things. Possibly a toilet in there. But uh, you can see it hasn't, it just hasn't been finished. And it never got to be finished. And I have no idea what happened. There's even plumbing over here. Guys, I'm going to leave it for now because uh, there's not much more I can show you. I can just show I can show you the the or, original video of this house before it was all smashed up, and I'm going to leave that link down below. Um, I just need to get out of here. The the, the the van is parked in the garden itself, and I don't want to draw attention to myself. I don't want to get blamed for all of this. Um, but uh, when you're out exploring folks and when you're out doing videos like this, um, just leave things as they are. Uh, this isn't good, you know. But um, I'll see you in the next video folks and as always, be good to each other.